Brian here with HelpSellMyRV.com out of Louisville, Kentucky, where all RVs and toy haulers are for sale by owner. And I'm going to do a walk around on this beautiful, fully loaded 2021 Grand Design Momentum 397TH-R Luxury Toy Hauler 5th Wheel. This is fully loaded. Has everything from the Onan 5.5 gasoline generator. Has triple large 15,000 BTU AC units with heat pumps. Does have the keyless entry. Has a tire monitoring system, has the upgraded 8,000 pound axles, Dexter axles, with the 17.5 wheels, and the tires are H rated. You have the full awning package, four power awnings on the outside of the coach. The ones on the side of the coach are fully adjustable, which the owners have taken advantage of for water runoff. That's definitely convenient. Does have the 12 and a half foot garage. Also has the washer and dryer that's a stackable unit, not the combo unit. And this floor plan does have two full baths in it. So usually on these large fifth wheels like this, with this floor plan, usually it would be a bath and a half, but this is two full baths. Let's go ahead and get started. A lot of features on this coach. Exterior length is 43 feet, one inch. The exterior height to the full walk-on roof to access your three large 15,000 BTU AC units is 13 feet, five inches. The garage area here, as I said, is 12 feet, six inches. And I took a tape measure from width to width, or side to side, from where you can take this door off. And I've got these French doors kind of unhinged and unhooked so we can open them up. Give you an example of what it looks like when it's open. And these doors do come off. Little pin here, right here, and you just, uh, unclick it and you can take these doors off so when the doors are off and you want to load up your toys this portion is permanent with the with the coach in the garage so from here to here side by side and top to bottom from the floor all the way up to this portion right here is exactly seven feet three inches let's open up this door And from the back wall there, all the way up to where the door closes is exactly 12 feet 6 inches. It does have the dual power beds and obviously the lower bed portion makes into a big booth. All the fabrics, everything are pretty much in excellent condition. I did notice this right here. Really this and in the pantry there's like a little bit of nip in the wood but this is the, the most damage you're going to find on this coach. Uh, any dealer would rate this excellent condition really kind of scoot in here give you an idea of the garage area looks like you have six tie downs and usually they're like 5,000 pound rated tie downs or D rings so you got six back here and looks like you have six more up front so you have a total of 12 tie downs. And these, when these beds are up, you have a power lift. And if you've seen any of these videos, pretty easy to figure out. Uh, power lift buttons right here. And these are gonna be all your lights and your awnings. But once that bed's up, you can put it up part ways and you can actually drop this bed down so it's flush up against the wall. In case you have something you want to really stack in here that's higher than normal but you also have the beds that can sandwich underneath and top of each other and just sandwich up into the ceiling there's one of your 15,000 BTU ducted AC units your ducted heat ducted AC all throughout 40,000 BTU furnace on this coach you do have a 5,000 BTU fireplace break the chill off uh, I believe it's gonna be a 36 inch flat screen in the garage area there's gonna be your full bath in the garage which is definitely convenient usually you're gonna get a half bath back here there's your fantastic vent fan with rain sensor little blue umbrella right there in the corner it tells you that it's a rain sensor so when it's raining and you're away it automatically closes and there are max air vent covers over the rain sensor, max air vent covers or max air uh, vent fans. And you do have, there is one ram vent here to get the gassy smells out. And there's also one back behind there, behind that couch there. And you are second entry into the garage area. 
Nice glass door, by the way. It separates the living room from the garage. You are insulated in the garage. You have R45 insulation in the floor and R40 in the ceiling in the roof. And you also have R11 in the side walls. And the slide outs are actually R25 or 24, which is surprising. All right, give you an idea of the floor plan in the living room here. Huge open floor plan in the living room. You do have the super slide. It's a huge slide out in the living room. This is gonna be your first slide out. Uh, it's gonna be a good 12 foot long, maybe even 14 foot long. And it the, the height of it is probably the most amazing. Uh, it's gotta be a seven foot tall slide out, at least. And it accommodates the, it's like a theater seating, huge theater seating sofa. And it'll all heat and massage, power reclining. And you do have LED lights. I thought I'd turn those on. I guess it automatically turns off. And the sofa is by Thomas Payne. And the fabric is going to be, uh, it's kind of like a patio furniture fabric. Obviously it's stain resistant stuff. It looks like an ultra leather, but it's not. It's, it's, it's more of a, a cloth fabric with, uh, with a finish on it. Everything pretty much is in excellent condition. A dealer would be more than happy to take this in on trade. Okay, in your kitchen area, this is going to be your second slide out. Accommodates the residential gas oven and stove top. And it's the four burner gas cook top, which is definitely nice. A lot better than the traditional RV uh, three burner cook top. Stainless steel finish beautiful oven looks like they've never used it and you do have LED light accent and a nice light for the oven just above that you do have the stain stainless steel finished microwave huge residential microwave by the way and uh, as I said this is the 397 TH R R stands for residential package and what is included in that is the 18 cubic foot Samsung refrigerator residential refrigerator electric refrigerator and it runs when you're driving down the road or you're boondocking it can run off your thousand watt dedicated inverter and this does have an ice maker this is going to be the largest refrigerator you're going to get in a fifth wheel i did check for any dinks on the stainless steel finish didn't really find anything just a little dirty a little stainless steel finish cleaner appliance cleaner clean that right up spin around to the island Solid surface countertops throughout. Full length metal ball bearing drawer guides. And you do have USB charging station here, 110 outlet here on the island. The owners did really didn't have a chance to detail it. They just kind of cleaned it up for me to get it listed. I've kind of been on them to, <laughs> to get it listed. I've had it coming soon for a couple of weeks on my website and I just wanted to get it listed as soon as possible. So it's a little dirty. It could use a little bit better detailing on the cleanup. Nice hutch area. You do have a Rockford Falls Gate sound system on this and these are your amps and I believe they're like 40 watt or 400 watt amps. Let's see if I can zoom in on right there. I believe that little number down there at the bottom right there that 400 portion I, I guess it's a 40 well it's 400 by 40 so I don't know what that means but Rockford Falls Gate sound system on this is going to be one of the best sound systems you're going to get on a fifth wheel here's your stereo here it's all Bluetooth a smart device ready and you do have the one control uh, monitoring system that I'll show you and you can tie that into your phone and operate all the features like the slide outs these are your adjustments for your speakers inside and outside Rockford Falls Gate speakers outside that I'll show you but that one control system can monitor everything on the coach from your your tank levels start your generator put your awnings in and out your slides in and out and operate your HVAC setup on this beautiful LED light accent up in the kitchen area in nice chandelier in the kitchen and all these lights are dimmable with that one control monitoring system and another AC system there. It's all 
Uh, it does have all the ACs have quick dumps on them, and I'll show that in the bedroom. This is your one control monitoring system, and I'll show that when we get ready to go outside. Definitely an awesome feature. It's kind of like the Vega system. Do you want to point out? It does have uh, motion detector lights for at night for safety, and that's your central vac. This is going to be your second full bath, the master bath. It is a one-piece shower with seating, which is definitely nice. Definitely one of the nicer or nicest uh, showers you're going to get in a fifth wheel. And I think they call that the super shower. Skylight. And a second fantastic vent fan with rain sensor. A little blue umbrella. And again, does have max air vent covers on all your max air vent fans. Pretty decent sized pantry here. Or I guess closet bin area in the bathroom and you do have porcelain toilet foot flush and again solid surface countertops and even in the bathroom and a medicine cabinet not just a mirror master bedroom they've done some upgrades on this uh, this is definitely not standard uh, it looks like they put a locking uh, doorknob in the master bedroom uh, there is something happened with the king bed mattress the mattress is gone because this is just like a little memory foam mattress but uh, I have to ask the owners about that but this is the king bed slide out this is the third slide you do have 110 110 yeah 110 outlets right there and USB charging for smart devices on each side of the bed there's your one USB charging right there and your 110 outlet right there. And kind of show off the headboard. Uh, it's going to be, the color is going to be like a gray color finish. You do have the MCD style roller blinds. As I always say, those are the ones you want, definitely. And this is going to be your third TV. Another 36 inch flat screen. And this is a stackable washer and dryer that the owners opted for. This definitely wasn't standard. Huge closet, and I do check all coaches. Uh, inside closets, cabinets for water damage, look for any wrinkling in the wallpaper and the wallboard, did not find any issues. Cabinet color is going to be a, like a charcoal gray, and I'll have the uh, cabinet color in the description. Usually I try to get the cabinet color at least in the description. The buttons for your slide out in your bedroom. And lights, let's leave that out. Okay. This coach is four seasons package installation. Uh, you have fully enclosed heated underbelly. You can go into, I think this is rated at like zero degrees. It's definitely nice. All right. On your monitor panel here, as I said, it's like the Vega system, if you're familiar with that. Uh, and you can actually tie this into your smart device and uh, go to home. We're already on home. And uh, let's see here. Just give you a, just an idea in case you haven't seen it. Just tap on it uh, for generator, and you can automatically set it for st auto start, uh, or you can manually start it like right now. I've got the generator running, and I'll try not to forget to turn it off uh, and the lights uh, all the lights are all dimmable in the kitchen I'll show you see this is the kitchen light it says counter kitchen counter light let me let me dim that down there we go and I'm gonna bring it back up I don't know if you saw that in the video, but uh, anyway, that is definitely convenient. You don't usually get dimmable lights unless you're looking at like two hundred, three hundred thousand dollar motorhomes. Let's go back here and show you. Let's go. Yeah, we're on home. Okay, let's go to devices and let's go to this right here, monitoring panel. See where you're on your um, holding tanks, and it just it takes about a second or two for it after you push the button. Uh, but here you are on all your tanks. 
and as I said you do have an auxiliary 40 gallon uh, freshwater tank you have a 155 gallon standard freshwater tank on this floor plan and you also have a 104 gallon black tank which is your toilet and a 104 gallon gray tank which is your sink and shower and uh, you have water tank heaters so you have heaters on all your holding tanks yeah, I'm sorry heat pads on uh, let me go back here that was yeah water heater switch so you've got water heater I'm getting ahead of myself uh, you've got a 12 gallon gas electric direct spark ignition water heater there's a flip out side if you want to uh, hook up to electric and use the electric at your campsite it takes about 15 minutes to heat up and HVAC system that's your uh, temperature controls climate zones in your garage bedroom and in the living room area you get the idea and your slide buttons and your awnings and you can do all this operate all this uh, through your smart device, your, your uh, cell phone. And we've already got everything. Got the, okay, we need to do the keyless entry. I always forget that. And I almost forgot. Generator. Let's turn it off because we're getting ready to go outside. There we go. Full gel coat finish. It's going to be one of the best uh, finishes you're going to get. On a camper this isn't just a high gloss phylon uh, this is full gel coat easy to clean the decals are in excellent condition did not find any issues the coach is a little dirty the wheels are a little dirty uh, I guess when they brought it back last time they use it uh, it was muddy and raining but uh, anyway look past the dirt it's a clean camper in my opinion you have the full four power awnings and the ones on the side are adjustable the owners have them adjusted for water runoff purposes you do have the frameless tinted bus style windows. They're like an 80% tent. Outside entertainment center on this coach, Rockford Falls Gate sound system. And I believe another 32 inch flat screen outside. Let's get this little arm, unhitch it. Slam latch baggage doors on all compartment doors. Gotta love them. These are gonna be your upgraded 17.5 wheels alloy wheels with the h-rated tires and this does have this coach is equipped with the tire monitoring system the cre 3000 suspension basically rides like an independent suspension and as as i pointed out this does have the upgraded uh, axles 8,000 pound axles all your tires are in excellent condition it's just dirty see nitro filled tires and you do have the six point uh, auto leveling on this this is your tire link monitoring system for your tires I'm gonna show you everything all the lights lights here and you do have lights in the tube but they also give you lights on the side so when the awning is in you still have patio lights all the awnings are in great condition a little dirty you do have LED light accenting up underneath the coach I don't know if you can see that 30 pound LP tanks, one on each side. Insulated slam latch baggage doors, by the way. And you got the little magnets up there. I always say they should have done the magnets a long time ago. HVAC system here. And oh, I turned the generator off. Okay. Uh, but you get the idea on that. And battery disconnect there saves you on your battery when you're storing it are not using it nice light with motion detector on it so you can leave this on it'll automatically turn off and you do have that's a little inverter button for your thousand watt inverter to turn it off and on huge garage by the way and you are ducted heat in the garage area which i'll show you another reason why it's the four seasons package on this back up here nice vent for your stackable washer and dryer dryer vent right there beautiful front molded painted fiberglass cap beautiful light LED light accent aggressive light accent on the front there oh, a little butterfly I thought it was a bee generator 5.5 only in gasoline generator they don't give those away the more ride pin box system on this this is definitely nice it's more of a convenient ride when you're driving down the road it's, yeah it eliminates the really the chucking you get beautiful momentum badge there on the front 
it's actually pretty clean on the front it's just got mud on the tires side view camera package and you do have a backup camera on this that definitely is not given away with the campers and just so i show you i did double check it it's a thousand watt inverter up there and that's for your refrigerator and that's your reservoir for your hydraulic leveling and there's all your hydraulic lines right there and a battery right there this is light to turn off that led light accent on the front let's go ahead and turn that off and let's close this see it's dirty should clean up pretty good and again it does have the full slide out awning package this is fully loaded i can't think of anything it doesn't have that they offered 30 pound LP tank there. The water hookups area here and your heated garage. And there you got duct work. There's the duct work right there. And you also have radiant heat. All your aluminum framing. This coach is a full aluminum frame construction. Six point auto leveling monitor or uh, operating system here. Follow the directions, pretty easy to figure out. Your water hookups area here. Whole house water filtration. Starting at the top, outside shower, hot and cold running water. To the right of that is your water pump, which is convenient. And this is for winterizing and just follow the directions for filling up your tank, uh, things like that. Pretty easy to figure out. And this is going to be city water hookup. Looks like they got a water pressure regulator on it, so you don't need a water pressure regulator. Black tank sewer flush rinses out your toilet up here in the master bedroom. You also have a black tank sewer flush in the back for the second full bath. This is the auxiliary fresh water tank 40 gallon fresh water tank that was an option the owners paid for it ice maker shut off yep if so if you want to winterize uh, you just follow this directions for the refrigerator and there's your um, gate valves or your dump valves the three pull valves there they're all protected from the elements low point drain valves and they're all up here protected from the elements hot and cold drain valve 110 outlet there cable hookups and light there you go ton of stuff on this slam latch baggage doors gotta love them 50 amp service marine style cord not sure where the cord is but anyway but stows up nice and clean this is your 12 gallon gas electric gas electric uh, water heater your furnace panel service panel there it's a 40,000 BTU furnace there's your exhaust for your generator and there's the LED lights up underneath fully enclosed heated underbelly there's two of your jack legs there's two more in the front of the tires and then two more in the back I do check all campers for delamination which is the bubbling on the outside did not find any issues 23 minutes man my videos are getting long and the owners do have it all leveled up and again tires are all in excellent condition just a little dirty Fuel station here, two 30 pound or 30 gallon fuel uh, tanks on this. One's for the generator, one's for your toys, and I believe you can tie them in together. And there you go. And it's held up by magnets. Let's let's shut that. There we go. There you go. Show you what it looks like when you're going down the road. Ladder to get up on your full walk-on roof. And there's some of your max air vent covers there right there and right there they don't give those away either don't know why but anyway yeah you gotta pay a pretty good penny for those and there's that Lippert patio system for the for the ramp door and of course you got a more ride step system that they have which is not a lot cleaner look and you also have them on the main entry there all right I know I didn't get everything. I couldn't have. There's a ton of stuff on this thing. But I try my best to get most of the features on it. It is fully loaded. So anyway, if uh, you want to come and see the camper, just call the number on the ad. You always deal directly with the owner. Or you can call 502-645-3124. If you like this video, I'd appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up. And if you have a comment, leave it below. Uh, if you uh, want to keep up to date on RVs coming for sale and toy haulers, you can always follow helpsellmyrv.com on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube.